Greetings, Game Girls and Game Boys! I am Contemplate, and this is Battle Zone. Yeah, uh, it went on sale on Steam, and I really wanted it, and, uh, because I have very fond memories of this game. This is a good, fun game, especially for beating your dad's friend in online back in the day when you're, like, 14 or so. But I'll tell you more about that as we play, so let's get started. Started. Let's just, uh, st uh, ooh, uh, well, okay. Mm, no, I think we're just gonna stick with the good old stars and stripes, the NSA, the National Space Americans. <laughs> there we go, there we go. Archives. So what we want is this one, the NSDF update. NSDF command is concerned about heavy rocket activity in this theater. So, uh, mission objectives. Get in a vehicle at Luna Outpost 3. Have the recycler build a scavenger. Escort the scavenger as it gathers biometal. Booyah. So this, it's a training mission, but of course, this is your guys' first mission. It's not mine. I've been around the block. I love these vehicles, too. Not all of them, but this one and the enemy's uh, light vehicle like this. They're awesome. I love them. It's a cool game. All right, let's see. There should be talking here in a moment, and I don't want to interrupt that. Ready? Sometimes it bugs me that Armstrong and Shepard get all the credit. But we all wanted to win the Cold War. And we were ready to commit our lives to getting the bio metal. The military boys used all the material that had fallen to Earth. And they still needed more. They went looking for a few cowboys to do the job. And in the end, they orchestrated the world's biggest cover-up. They snuck a whole army into space and not a soul knew a thing. It's pretty impressive. Now it's time. People should know why it's so important to win the space race. People should. They should People totally should know what happened to all those who are missing. The dead should get their honors. They should have their place in history. This history has been repeating itself. Cool. So true. Commander. All right. I'm going to deposit a biometal along with some strange radar signatures. Let's see. Get inside a vehicle. See, that's the Grizzly. Medium tank, a well-rounded battle tank equipped with four weapon hard points. Cool. What about this one? What's this one got going on? This is the Bobcat, a light tank, a lightweight tank that is cheap to manufacture. Features one rocket, one cannon, and one special. Specialized hard point. I don't know what that means. It's got one point of hardness. It's like James... James West or whatever, old school Batman and Family Guy. I've got one piece of, I don't know. I don't know what I'm saying. Thunderbolt, a heavy bomber, a fast moving but unmaneuverable vehicle. The Thunderbolt features two rockets and one cannon. Ooh, I don't think I've even ever actually used that one. That one sounds cool. And then this one's my favorite. Right here, the Razor, light attack vehicle, fast attack with light armor. The Razor features two cannons and one rocket, hard point. I don't remember a rocket. Yeah, I don't... Oh, the hard point is... Okay, I, this is not the vehicle I want, though. Mm. Huh. See, you can... And then you've also got your sniper rifle. There you go. You can snipe stuff. Boom! Take that building! <laughs> okay. Alright, this is the vehicle I want. No, wait, actually, I lied. This is not the vehicle I want. The vehicle I want is that one. Huh. Bloop, bloop. <laughs> High skills for you. Alright, let's see. Let's check out that, not that. Okay, this is the... I think we need, we were supposed to go to the scrap field. What's our mission? Objective, get inside a vehicle, use a recycler to build a scavenger. Okay, so you can either look at the structure and space bar and then press 1, or you can just press 5, Building. and it pulls it up. So, oh, such a good game. It's so well built. All right, scavenger, you get out there and do your stuff. What's over here? What is? What even is this over here? What is that? Oh, oh, a pop gun. Is that what that was? Maybe. I don't know. Whoa, wait, what? Oh, I don't like this. Oh, wait, is this the one that... Yeah, I don't remember what that does. Oh. 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 So, anyway. This is a freaking awesome game. I'll tell you the story now. So, uh, my dad had this game back when it came out. 
Grizzly one, we've got a situation. Oh. Unidentified vehicles are approaching your and if you hit L, it activates two of your weapons. Which is what I do to make sure that I don't get blown up. Ah, get over here, fool! <laughs> ah, you don't stand a chance. So you have to monitor your uh, ammo and your hull. Because if you take too much hull damage, you're going to get hosed. You're going to die. Uh, oh, it won't let me build anything else. Okay, that's fine. Oh, here comes another one. Got to watch that radar. Hey, leave my scavenger alone. Stop it. Oh, you turd. Stop. There we go. You can also notice uh, the enemy ejected. I'm going to wait for him to come back down, and I'm going to kill him because I don't like him. Even though I should probably... Oh, there he is. Oh, how cute. He's trying to shoot me. Where is he? Come on down, bud. There you are. You're doomed. And doom! That's what you get. Okay, now I better catch up to that scavenger. I'm going to be in trouble. I love the HUD on this game. Oh, there was another enemy, too. Okay, cool. All right, there he is. There you are, I see you. Come on, bud. This is my main tactic right here, is this side strafe. All right, where's that other one? There he is. So, you can play online, and my dad was playing with his buddy, and uh, they got tired of playing, or my dad got tired of playing, so uh, he decided, uh, hey, 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 son, would you like to take over this game and play against my bud? And I was just like, uh, yeah, sure, I mean, Heck yeah, I want to. I've been wanting to play this game, and you haven't let me, Dad. And uh, I started playing, and it took me a minute to get the hang of it. And, uh, of course, this uh, older man just totally whomped me. And uh, it was it was fun, you know, as the game. I didn't expect to win or anything. Uh, hang on, let's... Five, gonna have him pop up some ammo. Because I need ammo. There we go, nice. Oh, 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 okay. So, anyway, I think... Oh, the Soviets. Were you at, fool? Ah, oh, I saw him. So, anyway, mission complete. We have confirmed the invading units are Soviet. As the CIB believe, you can read the rest by pausing the video now, because I'm going to continue. Uh... The base, the brass wants you back at Eagle's Nest One, where you will take command of a, of all NSDF combat forces. Well, that's quite the promotion. Eagle's Nest One. Mission objectives: fight off attacking units, use a recycler to build defensive turrets, and stand by for additional hors d'oeuvres. This is General Collins, Commander. You're just in time. The first Soviet attack has destroyed all of Eagle's Nest One's defenses. Check your radar. We've got additional Soviet forces coming in from the southeast. They're targeting the command tower and our solar arrays. Protect these structures at all costs. Oh, jeez. They're starting right quick, aren't they? Hey, guys. How's it going? How about you get away from my freaking base? Dude. Stop. Stop it. Oh, here we go. I'm going to use a weapon here in a second. It's the thumper. Get out of my base. Oh my gosh, that did not help at all. Okay, I need to focus fire. I need to take one of these guys down before they destroy my command tower. Where'd you go? Where's the other one? There you are. Where do you think you're going, bud? You think you can leave the party? No. You're not reporting back to anyone. Get doomed. Ha <laughs> ha. So. Good. Yep. This will refill your ammunition. So these are nifty to have, but they're a little bit expensive. Okay, now I have to command the recycler to go to the geyser because they draw power from the geysers. I don't know how that works, but that's that's the case. So deal with it. Uh, anyway, I feel like we only played one or two matches, maybe more. I can't really be sure. I don't really remember, but <laughs> the last match that we played... Uh, we played in the same map more than once, and he was using a tactic that managed to let him defeat me. 
and I noticed what he was doing, and this is like my first story of observing what my enemy does and using it against them. And I have to admit, I'm still pretty proud of it because, well, I was a kid. <laughs> And I imitated what he was doing, but made a slight variation and managed to actually beat him. He got mad. Like, he was, I could tell he was legitimately frustrated. And I thought that was hilarious. But yeah, I was so proud of myself for adapting and beating him. It was awesome. It was such good times. Is that Earth? Earth! <laughs> Take that, Earth! Haha! <laughs> I don't know why I'm shooting at Earth. That's my home. So it was it was awesome. I, I've never had more fun playing of it. Yeah, that's a lie. So uh, as you can see, I'm following the objectives here and creating turrets. Where'd the other turret go? So you can also choose your defense right here by pressing two. And I only have two turrets. Why do I only have two? I thought I just made a second turret. Oh, I didn't make it because we didn't have enough uh, scrap. I only have seven pilots, so we gotta, we just gotta stay alive. Defense. Oh no, that was sorry. Utility. Defense. Turret three, right there. It's such a cool game. Like you have to micromanage it, and it can be really tough. But it is such a fun game. You can even take over the turrets if you really wanted to, which I don't, because I don't actually know how to make them land. Like deploy. All right, here come the enemies. I'm gonna thump them. Boop! <laughs> you suck! So that throws them off and stuff. If they're over a ridge, it'll uh, pop them up so you can see them. Oh man, I'm sitting here just getting ammo refilled as I murder. That is the ideal situation. I love it. So good. <laughs> I don't like the mortar. Like, the mortar's interesting. Like, you, th you thunk out a shot. Thunk. And if it hits an enemy, it'll blow up, or you push the trigger, and it blows up. But it seems like it just takes a lot of ammo, and it's just not, it's just not worth it. It's not my, it's not my jam, you know what I'm saying? Alright, what are you doing, Recycler? Get out of here. What's my objective? Uh, use Recycler to build turrets, set up defensive perimeter around the base, defend the command tower, and the solar arrays. Okay. Oops, bump. Okay, do we have enough for another turret? Yeah, we do. Man, I'm so good at this game. I mean, it's it's a simple game. I'm waiting to get attacked from the north. Building complete. And that's one of the other things that's pretty cool about this game is that you can... Okay, wait, where'd he go? There you are. Badger here. Badger here. Wait, that's Badger 3 that I just chose. I don't want Badger 3. I want Badger 4. Where's Badger 4? There you are. 4. All right, you go over here and protect our solar array. No, nope, lift off and go over here and protect our solar array. Just say no scrap or new scrap. I couldn't understand what you just said. Okay, let's see. Five, four. Um, oh man, there's another piece of equipment that I really want right now, but of course, these are the beginning missions, and I do not have access to them. There we go. Oh, no scrap on radar, so there's no more scrap currently. Oh, there's another enemy. Two more coming in. Just deploy you there real quick so I can spin around and get back into combat. Hey, buds. Hey, guys. Uh, uh, uh. How you like them apples? Oh, you don't like apples? Because you're a spaceman. Well, you're going to have to settle for these. <laughs> you suck. Okay. I feel like... I know I saw another duder eject, so we're going to wait for him to come down. Yeah, uh, that's a cool thing. Your enemies will bring you more scrap. For the using to murder. It's good times. <laughs> Where is he? I saw him eject. I'm not letting him get away. Where are you, buddy? Alright, also, your map, if you hit caps lock, switches to this map. What's over there? Why are there, why are there two blinking dots? Oh, there you are, you turd biscuit. We're gonna go to those two green dots, just because I want to. <laughs> oh, we missed you. We missed you. Hang on. Hey, bud, bud, you need a ride? Need a ride? Hey, oh, oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. I just thought maybe you needed a... Ugh, get down! I hate you so much. Oh, ooh, there are turrets here. What's this all about? 
This is a challenge area. It's like, hey, you want a challenge? Go blow up these turrets. Enemy turrets. Come on! Come on! Oh man, I've been playing with a trackball, so playing with the mouse is throwing me a little. All right, and before I die, we're gonna go back. Get some health and such. I still don't see any enemies on the map, though. Oh, there's one. Well, there they are. I see them on my map. There's some people coming in behind me, too. Hopefully these turrets will hold up. Okay, get some ammo, get turned around. Uh-oh. One of my guys is out in the boonies, about to get shot up. There you are, I see you! Thought you could sneak up on me? Uh-uh. No. Not a chance. Boom! Get out of here. Where are the others? I saw others. There they are. Oh, it's a tank even. Come on, punk! Yes, yeah! Alright, and there's another one coming in from over here. Come on, guys. So, that's one thing I've be been practicing a lot. Oh, you think you can just invade my base? No. Not happening. Uh, you can command. Oh, they dropped him. Yeah, I see you there. Get doomed. Alright, are there any left? I think those are such weird things in this kind of game. So now these guys are following me. You can command them by choosing them and then just pressing one and they'll follow you. Or eight and they'll follow close. So, and you can check the status of them, like my tank number two. I'm telling him to protect this, but really what I want him to do is get, uh, oh no, he's low on ammo, not health. Alright, so tank, follow me. We're gonna get you some ammo in one hot second. You, Badger, get over here. Get, get healed up. Who? Oh, jeez. Peace out, Eagle's Nest 1. We're gonna go party in Eagle's Nest 2. Oh, okay. Oh, that's right. They'll go on their own, so I don't even need to order them. Well, wait. Okay, there we go. I do. Okay, so I can also push 2, go to nav. Yes, sir. 2, go to nav. So now they're gonna head to the nav beacon, I think. Oh, well, maybe I need to choose a nav beacon. Oh, it's not letting me. What the junk? Okay, guys, let's uh, let's get the heck out of here. Remember those turrets in that gully over there? Don't go there. Just stay away from them. Stay as far away from them as possible. Yeah. Uh, here, here come some uh, Soviets. We're going to get them dead. There you guys are. I see you over there. Are you attacking? Yeah, you are. Get doom! Man, aiming in this game can be a real trick. Sorry, I'm focusing. This is a high-stress game for me. I really give it my all. Oh, yeah. Thought you could deal with me, but you can't. Oh, wait. Okay, are they attacking the base? Okay, you guys can have the base. We don't need it. Okay, it looks like those transports are just heading to the launch pad. That's fine. <laughs> Might as well give them a little more issue, huh? All right, let's get out of here, guys. Oh no! It's a massacre back at base! <laughs> no! Oh god, no! Oh! No! No, no! It's gonna be just a bunch of turrets just messing with them. Alright! Bring it on! Wrong game. Thank you. Lost Eagle's Nest 1 to the Soviets. We underestimated the Soviet strength. We underestimated their commitment to controlling the biometal. Now their intentions are clear. And if it's a war they want, then it's a war they shall get. We're relocating to Mars, where we will reassert our standing as the world's greatest superpower. Yeah, but they had to deal with those turrets that I pumped out right in the end there. <laughs> Whew, 
I should have I should have circled all the turrets together just to give them a hard time. But there we go, another mission complete. You bravely and your bravery and skill allowed the liberty, justice, and freedom to successfully evacuate our surviving moon force. You guys can read it if you really want to. The plot's pretty cool. It's a it's a pretty basic plot. It's a it's kind of an outdated plot, but there you have it. Uh, I love this game. I used to play it a few times. I don't remember if I actually got to play it very much, but I really enjoyed it. So, when I saw it on Steam, I had to get it. It's a good game. Plus, it's got all the expansions and stuff. How could I turn that down? But that's going to be it for this time, guys. Hopefully, you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you give it a big old thumbs up. Also, make sure to leave me a uh, comment down in the comment section, because I like talking to you guys. It's real fun. And uh, social media, yada, 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 description, blah, blah, blah. I will see you guys next time. Game over. We've only just entered the battle zone, but the war's already won.